finding a mirror for the first time. It's been in here with them the whole time, but we're just now discovering it. What's the matter, Simba? Uh, is that confusing a little bit? Is that a little confusing? Is that confusing? Well, I hung up on Mama's paint leg again. Last night when I came in, at day 25, Little Whisper was playing with toys for the first time. That was cute to see. This morning, when I came out of my room and walked down the hall, they heard me come down the hall and three of them started to scream. And we had a pretty bad storm last night and I hadn't been in to check on them since the storm had passed bright and early this morning. But I came in here expecting to see little scared kitties and they might have been little scared kitties, but they sure got excited when Mama came to the door. They started howling and hollering and screaming and running to the door at 100 mile an hour to see Mama. But they're just very playful this morning. We tried a little food again and it still wasn't, wasn't appealing to them. They sniffed at it. All of them took turns sniffing at it and walked away. But we're getting closer because they were sure sniffing at it this morning. These are my little sweethearts. 26 days old today. And Mama's starving. I try to come in three times a day and give her a can of kitten food on top of the dry food that she gets all the time. And just little baby cans of kitten food. Isn't he handsome? That's my Simba. This, this morning, Mama's coming in here, and she's going to clean this room. So we're going to have to put them up for a little while, and they're not going to like that. I'm going to put them in a big box while I sweep the room and mop the floor and put in all new bedding. And to one of the little ones last night, I walked over to the little kitty tower over there and walked onto the bottom of it, scratched a second, and then peed all over the kitty tower. So it's time to start using the litter box. Mom's got to get a box with a lower side so that they can get in it, though. The box is just a little too high-sided. Not much. They're almost there. They could probably make it, but they fall in. Just kind of fall in trying to get in there. I don't want them falling in on their noses. What are you doing, little one? You trying to climb Mama's leg? Hmm? And what are you doing, little one? Oh, they just don't get any more precious than this. I'm telling you. They're some of the most precious kitties I've ever seen. Just beautiful white little fluff balls with their beautiful blue eyes. And then there's Simba. He's quite the character. He and Mo are extremely active and alert and curious. Aren't you, Mo? And I swear Mo knows his name because he just started meowing at me when I said his name. And he did that last night and he did that yesterday morning too and I said little Mo and he turned around and meowed at me see I know he's already learning his name he likes his name don't you Mo I like your name we're everywhere now we're walking all over the room now I can keep my camera in focus it'd be really helpful we're walking all over the room now <clears throat> Nothing's going to hold them back anymore. And their legs are getting a lot more sure-footed. You don't want to go out there, Simba. There's big kitties out there. It's just too much of a world to tackle out there for you right now. Yes, it is. 
too much. Here's my sweet babies.